We lived in an age of wonders. We wove magic into steel and shaped the elements with our words. And yet, even in this golden age, there were stories of cities falling to darkness, of a force reaching from the shadows. We didn't believe them until it came for us. The beacons had always been a part of our world. We never knew who created them, or that someday they would return. the beacon. Somehow, these markings. I can do this. But I'll need some time. Precursor. We have to buy her some time. False one. This is vengeance for my people. This. I am sorry. Longer. Danielle. We are so close. You've done it. The light. Your gods are dead. Your world is ours. The hunt begins. Can you hear me? Quickly, follow my voice. Hip. Skylight needs you. Take the shard. I remember. I am Nis, the Blade of Shadows. My people are the Deep Eldren, ancient and wise, forgotten by the world above. But they have been lured down a dark path by treacherous spirits. When my clan refused to kneel, our people turned against us. Only I survived. Now this darkness is swallowing the world, but it cannot conquer me. I am the Blade of Shadows. 
And I will bring death to false gods who have broken this world. Praise the architects. I thought we'd lost you. We need to get you back to Skylight. There's no time to explain. You're trapped within the gloom. With that shard, you can cut through the shadows. You must move quickly. I will guide you as best I can. Shard. Get close to the anchor, the heart of this shadow. You must move quickly before it senses your presence. anchor of this gloom shadow. You must destroy it. Summon protection. Prepare yourself. The anchor is vulnerable. Focus your power through the shard. Destroy it! The path is clear, but the shadow is collapsing. Quickly, enter the portal. At last. Come, we have much to discuss. The Shadow Nation will not elude us forever, nor will their masters. One day, Nis, you will have your chance at retribution. I have need of your services, my friend. 
It is so good to see you again. I thought we'd lost you forever. Don't worry. Your memories will return, in time. That battle took place a year ago, and you were lost in the gloom. We've been trying to bring you back ever since. Let me show you. The Eldrin attack was a distraction. The beacon was always the target. We pushed past them and found the creature who was leading the attack. And you did what needed to be done. You fought to the bitter end. And your sacrifice bought me the time we needed. There's so much we don't yet know about the beacon. But its power protects this city. It destroyed our enemies and stopped the Gloom Tear from expanding. We couldn't close the Gloom Gate. But as long as the beacon remains lit, our enemies can't pass through it. And in the year that followed, we've studied it. Learned more about this gloom. Learned how to bring you back. We survived thanks to you. But the damage is done. Skylight is safe and the land around it. But beyond the highlands, reality is collapsing into the gloom. There may be other beacons, other places that repel the invaders. The only way to find out is to cut a path through the gloom. And for that, we need Wayfinders. We need you. Your sacrifice, and that of the others, bought me the time I needed to light the beacon. And the beacon's light holds the gloom at bay. It's the only reason we're alive. We still don't know. A year ago, the Eldrin attacked us and extinguished the beacon. And it was then that the gloom began to spread. It corrupts and consumes reality. The beacon protects us. But beyond its light, the gloom has swallowed the world, leaving only shadows and chaos. We don't know if anyone else has survived. That's why we need you. You survived in the gloom. You can do it again. With the tools you've been given, you can cut through its shadows. You must be a Wayfinder. We still know so little about the Gloom. And so much of the world has been lost to it. We need you to enter the Lost Zones, to find a path through the shadows. You've been through an ordeal. I shouldn't burden you with this now. It's best you see what's left of Skylight, and meet other Seekers. You were a Seeker once. You've just forgotten. Before the Gloom Fall, we investigated ancient mysteries. Now it's the Seekers who are working to keep Skylight and its people alive. Go to the Great Hall, up above the plaza. Wolf will want to meet you. We'll talk again after you've met with him and Lord Halar. Forces are depending on you. Welcome, Wayfinder. You honor us with your presence. I fought the Eldrin during the attack, just as you did. But it was your sacrifice that saved Skylight. Wolf. Before the fall, I was an officer of the Avar Imperium. Now I command our forces, such as they are. There are all too many threats. Shrikes, breaches. But you'll see for yourself soon enough. We will have much to discuss in the days ahead, and we'll have quarters for you soon enough. Much of Skylight was devastated in the attack. The builders are working as quickly as they can. You have more important work ahead of you. But for now, find Lord Halar outside of the Great Hall. He'll get you ready for the tasks that lie ahead.
Ah, how Omen expects me to work like this is beyond me. An Arcanist without his own tower? Absurd. Wayfinder. The new Wayfinder. Delightful. I am Lord Hala. As you know, my lands and the Dominion itself have been swallowed by the gloom. But even now, especially now, names matter. I lead the Arcanists among the Seekers. By necessity, we have focused our efforts on restoring Skylight. But it is my studies of the gloom that can help you, not my knowledge of Arcanic Illumination. What we know for certain is that the gloom alters flora and fauna, and never for the better. Where it lingers, it can consume entire regions, leaving only shadows in the gloom. What we call Lost Zones. You were consumed by the gloom, but you survived. Now you have the power to shape it, to some degree. The shard you've been given focuses this gift. Only a Wayfinder can enter a Lost Zone. But this is just a glimmer of your full potential. If you can enforce your will upon the gloom, perhaps one day we can undo the damage that has been done. But I can only tell you of the gloom. Omen can show you. Return to her, near the Gloom Gate, Wayfinder. She will guide you in the next steps of your journey. Your clan may have fallen, Nis, but they live in you. The gloom is consuming our world. Our beacon holds it at bay, but much was lost before it was lit. Beyond Skylight, you will find breaches where the gloom has ripped away pieces of our world. Using the Focusing Shard, you can pass through breaches to reach a shadow of what was lost, what we call Lost Zones. These are unstable and unpredictable, reflecting what was or what might have been. We're running out of time. The gloom is breaking down our defenses and we don't know how to stop it. We need you to explore the Lost Zones, to find a way to fight the gloom and reclaim our world. We do know the large gate behind me is the key. In theory, you can reach any Lost Zone through this gate. In practice, there are limitations. Usually, you must find and enter a breach directly to access a Lost Zone for the first time. After that, you can access it in any other breach you found through this gate. But you can't just stumble into a breach. You need a connection to the Lost Zone to guide you through it. This might mean finding an object from the zone, or experiencing an event tied to it. For now, I have a single connection I can share with you. The Codex Halls of Aurelian. There. Go to the gate. Follow the connection I have given you and return to the gloom. The shard you've been using is an incomplete tool. Find a Codex Ember in the gloom. Then we can transform your focusing shard into a full gloom dagger, allowing you to harness your full potential. is a lost zone. It's not a perfect replica of the world that was. It's a dream inspired by what was lost. When you return here again, everything, the layout, the creatures within it, may change. This lost zone is tied to Aurelian, a fortress monastery of the Avar Order of the Silver Codex. The Codex monks were conducting arcane research, and we need to know more about them. Aurelian was raised by raiders from the maze years before the Gloomfall. You'll need to establish your own connection to it. Yes. It was a miracle that we could pull you back to Skylight. But like your memories, some of your skills were lost. 
Don't worry. It will all come back to you in time. This connection I've provided is temporary and unpredictable. Look for a Codex Ember. With it, you can turn your shard into a full gloom dagger and establish your own connections. I can't guide you when you go deeper. To escape, you'll need to find the heart of this lost zone, the Anchor, and destroy it. This weakens the gloom and lets us harvest its energy through your shard. Explore as thoroughly as you can. We need the supplies and knowledge you may find, and exploration may grant you connection to other lost zones. Now go, and good luck. Another battle lies ahead. These vermin prey on the weak.
is this? Something new. Something interesting. I hear an echo in the darkness. You have promised, yes. But you don't have what I need. Not yet. Go ahead. Run along home. I'll be watching you, Wayfinder. feeling? Are your limbs working as you expect them to? Does your body feel reliably solid? As a Wayfinder, you aren't just a creature of flesh and blood. You shaped your body from the gloom, and it's your will that holds it together. It's, <laughs> it's remarkable. Because of this, you have powers you don't yet understand. Think to your recent battles. Have you seen flares of energy flowing from your fallen enemies? These are echoes, fragments of the spiritual essence of your enemy, traces of who they were. As a Wayfinder, you can fuse the echoes of your enemies into your own form. As you progress, you'll learn how to weave echoes into your weapons and even your relics. This is a crucial tool that can dramatically increase your power. I urge you to experiment with it. The Silver Codex studied ways to manipulate arcane energies. We can use the ember you recovered from Aurelian to create your Gloom Dagger and to establish your own connection to the ruins. You see, the shard you claimed in the Gloom is a rough and imperfect tool. You need to make it a true extension of yourself. A blade that can cut through reality. Use the Echo Matrix to combine the Ember and the Shard. Visualize the shape of your dagger. You can draw on the threads of the gloom and make your vision real. Try it. Storm and Shadow, you look a fright. Excellent, yes. Let me inspect it and make sure your work is complete. Shadow Dancer. Perfectly done. Woven from the pure elements of magic and drawn into reality. Now you have what you need to explore lost zones on your own. Let's review that procedure. To reach a lost zone, you need three things. A breach that serves as an entrance. A gloom dagger that can cut a path through the shadows, and a connection to the place consumed by the gloom. A connection can take the form of an object, such as the ember now bound to your dagger, or something more abstract, such as a memory or experience. You now have a gloom dagger, and through the ember you have a connection to the codex halls. So, what is it you are missing, Wayfinder? Have you been listening? Yes, just so. You need to find the point at which this area collapsed. You must search the highlands for a sheet of gloom energy. A hole in the world. Once you've found it, use your dagger to carve a path. Explore what lies beyond, and destroy the anchor of that shadow. Thereafter, you will be able to reach Aurelian through the gloom gate here. There you are. Your gloom dagger is connected to the beacon of skylight. 
Aside from being an invaluable tool for exploring the gloom, it also allows us to communicate through the link. A voice in the gloom? No, that wasn't me. I warned you that the connection would be unstable. Remain alert, but I'm sure it was just some manifestation of the chaos. Lord Halar and I spent much of this last year refining the daggers as we sought to retrieve you from the gloom. As for the shards, that's a tale for another time. But now, I need you to return to the Codex Halls. We need to know more about the work of the Silver Codex. I always thought they were peaceful, devoted sages. Now, I'm not so sure. Our work suggests they were experimenting with a sinister force that may have been the Gloom decades before the Gloomfall. This work could help us push back the Gloom, or reconnect our world. As Lord Halar has told you, you must first find the breach tied to the Codex Halls out in the wider world. And that means leaving the safety of Skylight. Before you leave Skylight, I need you to bind your dagger to the signal fires here. This will strengthen your connection to the beacon and help you move quickly across the region. Once that's done, take the lift down to the Highlands and find Warden Haas. She's in charge of our defenses. I will offer guidance when I can. I bid you welcome. <laughs>